We're getting close to the first round of Gotta Build Drift Series. Uh, and I just wanted to take the time to show you some of the work we put in before race weekend. Uh, we're always trying to improve this. Like uh, in the back in the days, we've all, uh, always had problems with getting the car down. So we have never had the time to do the proper preparations that we need. Um, trying to change that. So now it's Monday and uh, today we're uh, going through the caravan, cleaning it all out, get, getting a spring cleaning done, getting all of the shit out of the closet, and uh, yeah, making it fresh so it's good to stay in. Um, Robin is cleaning the rims since I got stuck in the mud. <laughs> He's a terrible off road driver. Yeah, the Vito is not a four wheel drive car for sure, that's for sure. Uh, so, yeah, the car is uh, done. Uh, we've done all of the small stuff, we have some small minor stuff to do, but nothing big. Uh, Jesper is building uh, our knuckles. Uh, these are uh, uh, Mercedes CLK knuckle, but uh, we uh, do some strengthening on them and also we changed the uh, hub to an E34. Uh, we just managed to get this done. Thanks to Anders who helped us make the spacer here to get the offset correct for the brake disc. Uh, then we're packing up all of the spares that we can have. Uh, front knuckles, rear knuckles, uniballs, oil filters, AM fittings, most of the stuff like steering uh, arms and all of that stuff. Uh, yeah, we're getting there slowly but surely. Uh, we have some uh, tires that has to be mounted at Theo Petersson, so we're trying to get these into the car and uh, deliver to them tomorrow, so they can be ready in time for Thursday when we leave. Uh, at the same time, uh, I just bought a hard drive to uh, be able to get all of the storage for all the event media this weekend. So just finished up to get everything unloaded, and we cleared up 400 gigabytes. So. The computer can work at its finest. Uh, I, it's unbelievable how fast that computer is compared to my old one. Um, it looks like we're going to bring the simulator to Volder as well. Uh, we're just going to try to figure out a good way to transport it. So, uh, yeah. Uh, that's some of the work we put in. So, uh, now we're going to continue working, get all of the stuff. Uh, prepped. Uh, one of the things we have to do in the CLK before the weekend is to uh, fit the new uh, trunk, trunk lid. Uh, we will see if we manage to find time to get it painted in time, but uh, we'll see. And uh, yeah, we're going to fit that up. We're going to do some kind of mounting point down here. Yeah, right now we only have these two. We lost one of the mounting points for it, unfortunately. So. Good, good. Uh, see you later. Oh. Oh, nice. Hope it's a good weather. I hope for good weather. Yeah. It would be good if it was like this all weekend, but it's looking like it's gonna rain. Yeah. Um, <coughs> so it's uh, Thursday. Uh, we're doing the final, uh, final uh, packing of the car and uh, the trailer. So right now we're going to head over to uh, Theo Petterson and uh, pick up all the wheels that have been uh, mounted with fresh rubber and uh, we're also going to go and clean up the truck after the car show last week. We got stuck in the mud, so it looks like hell, but it should be alright. So uh, yeah, let's go and get some stuff and uh, finish off.
How's it hanging? Are you pumped? I'm pumped, I'm stoked! <laughs> <laughs> Everything in between! <laughs> picked up from Tia Pettersson, huge thanks for them helping us mount the tires. Uh, so yeah, uh, we're about to leave the water, I'm excited for the track, it's gonna be a good weekend. See ya. is around uh, 7 now. <laughs> I've been up doing uh, some stuff but I thought I would uh, bike the competition line for one time so I can check out the zones and get a feel for it. So I'm uh, gonna try to show you the track as best as, best as possible. So this is the track linking up. This seems to be the starting line. Yeah. So as they wanted us to do was uh, as a lead driver keep in the left lane. Kind of a full on acceleration all the way up. Seems like a pretty long run up so they're probably going to shorten it but that's going to be discussed after first training. Full throttle here, touch kick, initiate. Probably by a Scandinavian flick or small Scandinavian flick to not lose too much momentum. <coughs> Long outer zone one. So it's uh, important to be very long out on the edge to be able to feel this. <coughs> then they want uh, mid track transition. So somewhere around here to set us up to keep the inner clip here. So they want us to take this one in the middle here without taking the curves. And then they want us to transition and slow down with angle. And we have a long outside zone again. And another mid track transition to set us up for the last inside clip. <coughs> also, here they don't want us on the curves 
they want us just outside the curve. Then transition, new track, and finish by the touch and go here, the Rheinmet sign. They don't want us to finish around here. So that actually, oh shit, that's a lot of rain. Sorry about that. <coughs> so yeah, <coughs> that's actually the first time I was biking the trip, uh, the track as well. So I might take another route just to check it out again. So yeah, that's the track. Got to build drift series round one at Wallerbahn. And uh, super excited about the new track. Yeah, I think it's gonna be good. More updates when practice starts. So when the <laughs> tech inspection guy goes in a Mercedes. <laughs> that stands live. Twig, twig drift at Instagram. That drug dealer life. Yeah, it has <laughs> a good uh, in S14 as well. Check it out. <coughs> yeah, it's finally time for practice. Uh, it's raining a lot, as you can see, so it's going to be a wet training session. Uh, we're just uh, warming up the car, going to warm up the gearbox, fix everything over. I'm just on the GoPros now, so... Yeah, if everything goes to plan, we're going to do some solid practice and hopefully have a good time. Oh, eventually it's going to go. First time being here as I told you and uh, today we had our first sessions on the track we started out with some practice in the morning it was a uh, very wet conditions as we expected uh, our second uh, session out uh, we had a like a dry spotty track so it was a bit uh, bit tricky conditions but nothing too bad uh, we managed to get quite comfortable in the early runs with the grip but uh, uh, because I'm not used to this amount of grip that we have with the KW suspension, I uh, struggled a bit to get used to it. But um, after the second training session later that day, uh, we had a better flow and we felt a bit more confident going into the qualification. So uh, we just finished qualification and uh, we started out with the first run where we went in pretty hard. Uh, we came into here and unfortunately I didn't attack as much as I wanted to and uh, I happened to straighten out. The car gripped up and we did a small straightening and that ended up being a zero. So. After that we headed out for our second run. I was a bit nervous because I wanted to get into the show of course. Uh, so we did our very best, we put down uh, another uh, run. <laughs> This 
time we managed to set the whole course. But uh, we only got a 70 and unfortunately we got out with uh, only three points. So that's a bummer I guess, but uh, I, I seem to have found a new favorite track. So uh, I'm really excited about going out for the drift sessions tomorrow. So hopefully we can uh, have some fun with other drivers like Fredrik Ospo and some of the other GDS drivers. So uh, really thankful for all the team and all the sponsors who made this possible because the car is working great. Uh, it's just me that we need some work. So. Uh, yeah, that's everything for now. Uh, can't wait to show you some awesome content from tomorrow's uh, Got to Be sessions. day two of Gatebil and uh, today we uh, had some serious fun on the drifting sessions and Gatebil show show uh, yeah Gatebil drift show that's for the Gatebil drift series guys who compete um, we did some runs front and back but after a while the car ended up bending its um, what's it called uh, tie rod no not tie rod suspension arm in the back I will show you later and so we decided to quit for the day and it looks good, like it's gonna be bad weather tomorrow so we're gonna go pack it all up and uh, head home uh, early in the morning and now we're going up to the got to be drift series top 16 and checking out some drifting so yeah by the way it's raining again Hold on, what are you playing now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm glad. You're going to be with me. Hey, hey. Are you close? Yeah, we're close. Yeah, you're close. 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 Kjøver masse alt i lenge her, Mikkel Johansson. Ja, ja. Åh! Og så står det da mellom Evel André Vågen og Johan Andersson. Ja. En norsk erfaren regnfører, svensk mester. Gatvild Drift Series debutant, men mester. Og vinneren er... Johan Andersson! Hold den med på, selvfølgelig, Emil André Vågen! Så 
So guys, it's uh, Sunday. It's raining like hell. We're pretty happy about packing up yesterday. So <clears throat> now we're heading out for Sweden again. Uh, really thankful for all the guys who made this weekend such a good one. And uh, thank you to the team who made an awesome job, as well as Digify who yeah, Digify Media. Fi yeah, we, fixed the media. Yeah, we managed to, to cut the two videos together this event, so I'm pretty happy, you know, yep. working, working uh, fast, in a fast workflow. That's uh, what I'm working on with my red cam, right? It's not, uh, <laughs> it's not easy to do. Heavy yep. files and raw files and uh, editing on the, the fly, it's not easy. And um, yeah, you need a lot of resources. Uh, so you did a good job. Computer, but yeah, we, we managed two videos. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, let's go home. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. Woohoo! We're home. Finally. It's been a long drive, but uh, yeah. getting the car off the trailer, getting it into the shop, and uh, then going home. Probably gonna pass out on the couch, but that's good. Tired? I haven't driven. <laughs> 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 <laughs>